The roots of Montenegrin Electrical Transmission System, CGES, date back to the year 1954, when the company Dalekovo Titograd, transmission line Titograd, was founded on January 8. Dalekovod consisted of two plants, one for transmission and transformation of electrical energy, as well as the maintenance of transmission network facilities, and the other for the construction of these facilities. The company covered the southern and central part of Montenegro, and in the following year, 1955, Electroprenos Bielopolje, Electrical Transmission Bielopolje, was founded for the northern region. Two years later, it merged with Dalekovod Titograd. In the 1960s, during a major development in the Montenegrin power system, a substation Podgorica 1 was constructed. New transformers were installed with sufficient capacity to cover the entire consumption of electricity for Montenegro at the time. The achievement was met with great celebration by the entire nation. In 1961, the company was renamed Electro Montenegro Titograd, and by the end of 1975, it was merged with Montenegrin power plants Nikšić to form Montenegrin Electric Enterprise. It is by no coincidence that the company day is celebrated each year on the 1st of July, as this date marks the establishment of modern electrical transmission in Montenegro. As far back as 1957, the first major substation 110-35 kV Nikšić and the first 110 kV overhead line Jablanica Mostar Nikšić were put into operation to provide power for the then industrial giant steel mill Nikšić and for the town of Nikšić itself. In early 2009, following the liberalization of the electricity market and coinciding with EU regulations, the shareholders' assembly of Elektroprivreda adopted a decision on establishing a new shareholder company, Prenos. Today, the company renamed Montenegrin Electrical Transmission System, JSC, represents a modern and complex structure strongly linked with neighboring country systems. CGES has a total of 329 employees forming a highly qualified staff comparable to those found in scientific and higher educational institutions. Certain sectors of the company are staffed almost entirely by university graduates, some with master's degrees and PhDs. Undoubtedly, the greatest merits of the company's success can be attributed to its employees, as they represent its true capital and the main driving force behind CGES. Besides its head office, CGES performs its main activities through two organizational units. Electrical transmission is responsible for the maintenance and development of the network consisting of 21 substations at 400, 220, and 110 kilovolts, and more than 1,300 kilometers of overhead lines. The total transformation capacity of the Montenegrin transmission network is 3,287.5 megavolt amperes, with 44 transformer units. Three power plants operate within the network. The thermal power plant Glevia, and hydro power plants Piva and Perucica. In addition to providing electrical energy for general consumption, the network serves important direct consumers such as aluminum plant Podgorica, steel mill Nikšić, and the railway infrastructure of Montenegro. The brain of the electrical power system of Montenegro is the National Dispatching Center of Podgorica, or NDC. From this center, Montenegro's generation and transmission facilities are operated and monitored, and data is exchanged with neighboring countries and other operators, producers, suppliers, and electricity traders. NDC employees, besides possessing technical skills and in-depth knowledge of national and neighboring systems, also possess the calm and capacity to find the best solutions under unforeseeable circumstances. Employing the latest technology and modern equipment, the NDC is prepared to handle their challenges. In 1999, SCADA, a control and monitoring system, the most original technical solution in Montenegro and the wider area, was installed and implemented by the NDC team. The system is constantly being improved and upgraded with more than 10 million euros being invested in the NDC alone in the previous period. 
In 2011, CGES started a new investment cycle, preparing itself for one of the biggest power projects in Europe, the connection between Montenegro and Italy via a submarine power cable. Part of the project is the construction of the Lastva Plevia overhead line and the substation Lastva. The implementation of this project will prove the strength and stability of the company in cooperation with Terna, its strategic partner from Italy. In recent years, CGES has significantly improved its network. The Podgorica Albania overhead line was constructed to a length of 30 kilometers over the territory of Montenegro and in accordance with European standards. A substation Mojkovac was reconstructed and substations Virpazar and Podgorica 5 were constructed. The first 110 kilovolt underground cable was laid in Montenegro, connecting two substations Podgorica 3 and Podgorica 5. The Kotor Shkaliari substation was also constructed, complying with the latest GIS technology. The plant is filled with gas instead of air. All of these developments have been implemented to provide a safer and more reliable power supply to consumers. Among the most important projects implemented is the installation of optic telecommunication cables in overhead lines, which has improved the reliability, monitoring and control of the network and decreased costs of internal communication. The project has also enabled the leasing of optics to telecommunications and other companies. Installation of microprocessor protections at all voltage levels continues and the connection of the first wind farm to the Montenegrin electrical transmission system is underway. CGES plans to invest 130 million euros in new projects and developments by 2018. In 2013, CGES claimed two prestigious awards. Selected by a jury of experts of the Regional Independent Directorate for the selection and promotion of best managers and companies, and by nomination of the Montenegrin Chamber of Commerce, the CGES Chairman of the Board of Directors won the title Best Manager of the Year, while CGES was awarded the title Best European Company. From the very beginning of its operation, CGES has set socially responsible business operation as its top priority by sponsoring a number of sports teams, including, among other European champions, the women's handball team Buduchnos. The company provides support to humanitarian organizations, primary and nursery schools, disabled persons, and expert training for talented individuals, and acts as a patron to numerous cultural events. From the connection of the first substation in Nikšić to this day, the Montenegrin electrical transmission system has traveled a long way. The company's main objective over its decades of change and innovation is and has always been a satisfied customer of the electrical transmission system.